गुड मॉर्निंग टुडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट सुपरफिशियल वेलोसिटी एंड सीपेज वेलोसिटी लेट अस कंसीडर डार्सीज ला एज पर डार्सीज डार्सीज ला वी इज इक्वल टू के इन टू आई वेर के इज परमेबिलिटी ऑफ द सॉइल आई इज हाइड्रोलिक ग्रेडियंट इफ वी पुट आई इज इक्वल टू वन इफ यू पुट आई इज इक्वल टू वन permeability will be equal to velocity so v is referred as the this v is referred as the superficial velocity or fictitious velocity why it is fictitious velocity or superficial velocity because the actual flow is through the pores in the cross section not through the entire cross sectional area see here in case of darcy's law suppose this is the soil sample and area cross section is a and length is the l in case of darcy's law this cross sectional area is taken but actually actually the flow is through the pores in the cross section not through the entire section the permeability of soil can then be defined as the superficial velocity of flow under unit hydraulic gradient see here from this equation if we put i is equal to 1 k will become velocity the actual velocity of water flowing in the voids is called seepage velocity this is the actual velocity and this is called seepage velocity if we consider the discharge q then q is equal to va is equal to vs into ab as per continuity equation where ab is the area of the voids in the total area since ab is equal to a is equal to vb into divided by v is equal to porosity vb by v volume of void divided by total volume is nothing but porosity hence v is equal to n times vs where vs is seepage velocity so this is the difference between seepage velocity and superficial velocity remember in engineering practice for the sake of convenience v means superficial velocity is used instead of vs that is seepage velocity one more thing since porosity n is less than 1 the seepage velocity is always greater than the superficial velocity or discharge velocity thank you thanks for watching